welcome back to my channel and if you remember from my last video I went shopping at a pets at home shopping bag so in this video as I said from my last video I'm just going to be showing you what I got from the shop and um, yeah it's going to go through the item and um, if you are watching this video relax maybe get yourself a nice cup of tea um, it's a sit down video so we're just going to be talking about some of the items that I've purchased and um, hopefully in an upcoming video those items will be in a cage setup so let's go through the items Okay, so I'm going to be opening my bag now and I'm just going to be showing you the items. So let's have a look at what we've got. Some of you might know these items if you've been to Pets at Home or even if you've checked out them online. So I have got these three wooden chew sweets and I mean look at those, you get blue, you get green and you get like an orange and reddy colour. Um, love these, they would look really pretty in any cage or even in a cage theme depending on what theme you're doing but they're great gnawing toys for small animals. So yes, I'm liking those and they look really, and they do give you a little symbol here of every single um, animal that can actually have these as well. So you've got rats, rabbits, Syrian hamsters, um, dwarf hamsters, chinchillas even. So yes, yeah, so I like all the information on that. So those are really cute little sweets. Also, I have got these macaroon chews and I do like those because look how pretty they look and they come in green, pink and yellow and I just think that they would look really cute in a cage, um, really um, pleasing to the eye and again they give you a selection of all of the pets that can have these as well so I really like the look of those so really nice. And don't worry, I'm going to show you everything um, afterwards, so we'll have a good look at those. And what else have I got? Right, okay, so I've got these bake, baked bites biscuits with raspberry and cranberry. So, um, yes, these are looking really cute. I'm not sure what they, they kind of look like baked little cakes. Um, if you can have a look at those. And you can see they're in different, like a light, darker pinks and light pinks, so really nice. And again, lovely um, when you're serving it into the little bowls, so that can look really pretty. So I like those. Okay, what else have we got in here? So this is a play tree, and I might have seen these. I haven't seen these before um, and when I do shop I kind of go to Amazon because I'm with Amazon so um, I don't really see these um, but this is a play tree and it is a chewable texture so it's great for gnawing, um, encourages natural behaviour so yes there is this one as well so I can't wait to really put these in the cage because I'm loving all the vibrant um, colours right now so we have that and then over here we have the cheese hideout and I love this so look at that so it's kind of hollow inside and then you've got the hole so you know it's like a comes out perhaps it will come out the hole and it just looks like a piece of cheese and again they can gnaw on this as well so it's like a two-in-one hideout that they can actually eat so that's great and here how, how solid they are as well um, okay so from the same kind of range I've got the carrots 
and if you're looking at my video you might have seen all these in the video as well um, so again I've got the carrot and also what else I have here is the play bridge so this is the bridge as you can see and it's in green and orange and it complements your carrot it also complements your little tree here and also your cheese as well so look at this um, little bridge here and again perfect for gnawing on so that with the beautiful colours and vibrance and they really do stand out I don't know how it's coming across on the camera but in real life it really does stand out so yes these will be going into the cage at some point and last of all what I've got is the small carrot cottage and this one um, I have think I got one similar to this from Amazon and it was large but this one is a little small one so it's great because you, sometimes you don't want things to overtake the cage but you want the things so this is a smaller size which is perfect as well for a dwarf hamster but it doesn't take all of the cage and they love and I remember from my last one they really did love eating the little bits on the top here the little treats on the top so that was great so it became a great gnawing um, toy and also again with the hideout as well so they would just go in there and it's hollow on the inside so these are the things that I got from pet at home and I'm really happy with my purchase I can't wait to actually be putting these into the cage I'm not sure what theme I will go for um, but yes I know that Easter is coming up soon mm. um, nice vibrant colors and Easter is very vibrant time so might be an Easter theme cage, we'll see, but um, definitely loving all of the things. I do hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you enjoyed some of the items that are here and maybe you might be interested in purchasing these items. I probably put a link down below and it will just be to the Pets at Home um, website so if you just click on that link it will take you straight there and I'm sure that all of these things because they all are in stock at the moment um, so they will all be there if you are interested. So what I will do is give you a close up of all of the items that I purchased in this video um, so you can see them up close. I can feel it. Somewhere inside haunting Like a drug I keep on wanting There's a love that fits so perfect It's hard to believe There's a reason I can feel my heart stop beating And the air gets tough just breathing I'm alone but I'm still feeling Like someone's with me It's strange video if you are new here then a very big welcome to you please do not forget to subscribe to this channel and if you enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up and a big thank you for watching and I hope to see you all again in my next video